Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, geezers and gazelles, what's up, Mr. Mistakes Made here, and I'm back. Did you miss me? I hope not, because, you know, I don't I don't want you to think that you depend on me that much, that when I'm gone you're like, no, Martin's not here anymore, what's happened? I'm fine, I'm not dead, I've not disappeared, I've not been abducted by aliens yet, I don't quite think. First of all, I want to thank everyone who um, has showed some concern while I've been away. They've been like, where are the videos, man? Come on, come on, you're slipping. Where are the videos? Where are the videos? Well, um, let me explain. Life kind of overtook, uh, as it does sometimes. You know, stuff happens and you become demotivated and unmotivated. Demotivated isn't a word. However, we'll just forget that because this is quite emotional for me. So please, just bear with me. You become unmotivated and, you know, you kind of lose your passion sometimes. Sometimes you're kind of like, which road do I take? You know, where do I go? And um, that happened to me. I had a lot of stuff happen in the past few weeks. Like... With the whole my Nandine thing, I don't want to bang on about it, but it kind of... Oh god, I'm sorry, oh god, sorry, I thought I'd just load some random gameplay and show you my Skyrim stuff. I forgot I was getting attacked by a crazy Night Prowler thingy. Um, I'm about to die. Anyway, yeah, so um, that kind of hit me quite hard, and, you know, the whole realisation that she'd gone had kind of, you know, oh, I'm dead, um, had kind of, you know, hit me, and I was like, shit, what do I do? Um, so that happened, and then my PVR started messing up, which you know. It's kind, of, it's kind of detrimental to me uploading videos, so the PVR, it started lagging on me, started dying on me, so I had to get that sorted out. And then my Xbox died, which is awesome. It didn't die per se, um, it wouldn't read my discs. And I know there's a whole trick about punching it and making it work, and that worked for a while, but then it got to a point... Funny story, this. I, um, I bought Modern Warfare 3, and I was quite enjoying it. I'm not really a COD fan, so I was quite enjoying it. You know, I was quite happy you know, getting some levels up. Yeah, yeah, it's all fun and games. I come home the day after, and my Xbox is doing its trick where it doesn't work anymore and stops reading discs. I punched it. It didn't work. And I punched it again. It didn't work. So while it was standing up, I thought it would be a good idea to punch it. Like, literally punch it really, really hard. And it fell over and destroyed Modern Warfare 3. And this was, like, 12 hours after I bought it. So within 12 hours of adding Modern Warfare 3 and about 3 hours of playing it, I, I broke it, which was awesome. Um, so... I had to get a new Xbox, um, and Xboxes aren't cheap, and I'm not exactly a rich guy, so um, this is going to come as some crap news to some of you, I know, but I had to, you know, I had to get some money together, I had to trade in some games, those games being the ones that I was Let's Playing on, and it was a sacrifice I had to make, it was either like, I trade in the games that I'm Let's Playing, or I don't play Xbox at all and don't upload anything at all, so um, um, at the moment, for now, uh, Dead Island and all that, I kind of are on hold. You know, I might pick them up again when it gets a bit cheaper, but with Christmas coming up, I don't really have the, the most money in the world. So, um, so please bear with me. I will get back to them at some point, and I'm sorry for everyone who was looking forward to seeing the rest of them. I really, really am. But like I say, I didn't have much choice. Um, however, I have Skyrim. Yay! Skyrim is, is possibly my new favorite game of all time. I absolutely adore it, and I hate these night power things. They're really, really irritating. Um, and I still have Arkham Asylum, and what else do I have? I have Saints Row the Third as well, so um, I could do some gameplays on those. As far as Let's Plays go, um, until I get a game which isn't Skyrim, because I'm playing this for like 30 odd hours now, um, and I'm quite far into Saints Row 2, I won't be doing Let's Plays. But I will be doing little snippets of gameplays. You know, maybe the old quest on Skyrim. I'll show you uh, my my take on things because I tend to do things very very differently to the way the designers intended them to be. So uh, that could be quite entertaining. And Saints Row, Saints Row is just fun to watch. So I'll do some of that. Um, I got a few new series ideas coming up soon, one of which being like an indie kind of arcade game highlight where, you know, I play like, um, if you're like me and you buy quite a lot of stuff in the marketplace, every now and again you end up with like 200 Microsoft points that you just can't do anything with. And um, I tend to buy quite a lot of indie games because, you know, some of them look quite fun. So I might do I might do little highlight sections and show you guys, you know, if you've got like 80 Microsoft points lying around and you want a fun game to play, then... Um, I'll show you which one's the best of the bunch. That's that's one idea I have. I have a few others floating around, but um, this is basically me just saying I am back. It won't be as regular as it was, because I don't have the games anymore, but it'll be three, four times a week. Um, like I say, I just want to thank every single person who was so patient as to wait around. I want to say thank you to my new subscribers. I don't know where you came from. I don't know why you subscribe, because I'm not uploading, but it doesn't mean I don't love you any less. So, uh, yeah, just to clarify, I am back. Everything's fine. I've gotten over any life troubles I had, I've refound my motivation, and, and, this weekend, I'm going to, uh, to meet someone I've talked to for about five years. Like, if you're like me, you do a lot of online gaming, and you meet a lot of people, but you obviously don't actually meet them. And, um, yeah, I've been talking to this girl called Tony for, like, five years. We met in Halo 3, back in the day, and, uh, we've talked quite a lot for the past five years, and I'm finally going to meet her at the weekend. 
So that's going to be pretty sick. So um, I'm looking forward to that. Also, look forward to some footage of that as well. It should be quite a laugh. She lives in Birmingham, and I live in Devon, so it could be cool. And yeah, that's really about it. That's all I've got to say, guys. I hope you're all doing well. Um, I hope you're enjoying whatever you're doing. Um, I want to say congratulations to Magic Wizard and the Johnny Cage. You guys are doing really, really awesome. And also the Rainy Day Gamers, you all seem to be building up really high, and I'm glad to be back with you guys. Um, and I look forward to many more humorous adventures in the future. But for now, that's all I really have to say. So take care of you guys. Uh, I love you, and as always, I'll speak to you again soon. Bye!